Hey guys, this is day three in Granada, and um, I just we're about to enter the area. This is um, a South African market, I believe. Lots of trinkets, lots of trinkets in here. so cool for your verified. That wasn't obviously going for you. Yeah, I know. What about that? Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, uh, cool place, guys. Oh, you're all there. Yeah. I only want one of the national park. Mm -hmm. We just get to see what the stores are. Place still like a Hey guys, so we just left the south the market that we were just in. Um, and we're sitting in this square right here. Beautiful. Uh, with another fountain. And so far we have done the Alhambra and Sierra Nevada National Park. And then today we go to the Albaicín area. And then we go from there to see San Nicolas, which is in the same area. Same area. And uh, yeah, we're going to need the tour of Granada. So, this is uh, beautiful. Oh, there's the babe right there. Yeah. Cool. You see there's another Los Diamantes? No. I never even know what this is. I don't know. I, didn't, I don't know, but this is a great little square. Yeah. Oh, Plaza de Bibramba. She's really good at Spanish. What? No. Huh? <laughs> 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 Alright, we'll see you guys later. Hey team, as I had said, we are going up to the Albacine area. And uh, that being said, we have passed this, so check out this view. This is the Alhambra and the National Park, so both the things I've done the last couple days. I just turned this off, but I figured I'd get it out. This is the Paseta de San Nicolas. Nicola. So. White stone, white buildings everywhere.
turn into another little plaza. I'm gonna show it around. Romans are supposed to dance, and after that, they forgot, they how, forgot they, how to dance, and they throw just the, the dirt, waste. the dirty water, when yeah. the Romans used to irrigate it. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine just like walking and being like, waste water. Yeah. Just a, just a cool little place. The ground, you know what the sidewalks look like. Once you get out of like. You know, the city center. So, there's uh, some walls of the Alhambra at the very top there. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's crosses. But again, this is the week for crosses. It's Holy Week. Yep. Street, so I'm gonna turn this off. But this has been a lot of fun. It's such a cool town. Really cool architecture. Really cool everything. Okay. Continuing our walk around Granada. And we have a really nice view of the Alhambra from here. So I figured I'd stop and get it. Oh, lemon tree and oranges, naranjas.
It would be perfectly right. Wow. Here is very little shore, but there's the moat. There's the river that surrounds the castle. So that's actually called the Gold River. That was mined by the Romans for gold in about the year 300, um, according to our tour guide that we had yesterday. And um, the it was given it was taken over by the French in the 1800s spent a ton of money to try and mine and irrigate the water and everything and they got almost no gold and went bankrupt the company did how funny is that so okay, the Romans were so good at what they did they just got everything and the systems that they used are still used today Granada. We just stopped for wine. Oh, look at that. Dude. And then uh, we're standing on the bridge. <clears throat> uh, I, don't worry about that. I got. A, I took a picture of Todd here earlier. On the bridge. Anyway, we're this is our. This is our favorite tapas place we've come to. And we just left. It's one of the most famous in the city, and it's fantastic. We ordered fresh churros. It's making fresh churros in Spain.